know, it's always fun to talk about the perfect Thanksgiving, but it's even more fun to talk about the worst Thanksgiving ever. So <laughs> let's talk a little bit about Thanksgiving uh, mishaps. As you mentioned to me, you have to cook in order for there to be That's a mishap. Right. So That's I don't right. have any, okay? Uh, let's start, Ashley, with yours. Do you have any stories for us? Yeah, actually, I'm sort of stealing my husband's story. I mean, I was present for it, okay. so I feel like I was a part of it. Um, I don't really cook either. <laughs> so somebody else had created the gorgeous turkey, and my husband was taking the opportunity to walk the platter out. You know, it was beautifully done and whatever. And my, I have a Newfoundlander. I don't know if you guys know what that is. about a 115-pound ball of hair. Big dog. That's black, the same color as the floor. And she has this amazing ability to perk her head up when you're stepping over her. It's really adorable. <laughs> so anyway, she, my husband's like carefully to the table. And as he's stepping over her, doesn't she just lift her head? He goes flying, platter, potatoes, turkey, all over the floor and all over her. She was like licking her forehead for like an hour. I didn't even know her tongue was that long. I mean, it was just vile. I mean, think of the newfie hair. It's like this fuzzy, oh. sticky. Oh, yeah. He was to say that. Everything was sides that evening. Yes, whatever no, not, didn't make it on the platter was what we ate. Not salvageable. Yeah. No, yeah. not off the dog. No. Okay. No, I mean, there's no five second rule there. No Trace. way. Yeah, no. There's no five second rule. Chef, I would love for you to dish. Anything going uh, wrong in your kitchen? Not going wrong, but it was kind of funny. It was uh, probably about 10 years ago when I was a chef at the Millcroft. And yeah. this was around when deep frying turkeys wasn't really common. Okay. And uh, I got right in the middle of service, Thanksgiving service. The phone rings in the kitchen. I pick it up, and it's, it's a customer asking me how to deep fry a turkey. Okay. But I'm like, this has got to be a prank. Like, you don't deep fry turkeys, you know? Yeah. So I'm totally convinced that this is some radio show that's calling in, and I'm like, you know, I'm sorry, but you don't deep... No, I saw Emerald Legacy deep fry this turkey. I'm like, you don't deep fry turkeys. And this went on through the whole of service, and it was basically then I get up the next day and find out that he you was deep frying turkeys. Deep fry turkeys, yeah. it yeah. happens. I really thought I was getting pranked. <laughs> Have you ever tried one yet? Nope. Deep frying no, it? I'm not doing it. You're not doing no. it? It's just against the rules. I'm all about it? tradition. You know? Okay. 